Say man, hey man. It's your boy Do It All Hall, and I'm back with another NBA 2K24 Next Gen build video. And today I have a special John Morant build for you guys. Even though John Morant is not playing right now, he is, he is still John Morant. Okay, so we have some good finishing on this build. I want this build to have the pro contact dunks, the elite contact dunks, but being that we are six foot two, we can't get both of the elite contact dunks, but we can not get both of the small contact dunks, one elite contact dunk, and two pro contact dunks. So I think that's pretty good. Make sure you watch the video to the end so I can show you this masterpiece. Choose the end of your choice and the jersey number of your choice. Let's get it, man. But before I go into further, you already know what time it is. If you don't know now, you know. There's a like button time, and I need you guys to go down there, hit that like button, get this video to 100 likes. And if you haven't already, hit the link in the description to join the Discord. So with this build, as you can see, we're going to point guard position, six foot two for the height. 198 on the weight, 611 wingspan. Let's get into the build. So when I was creating, well, trying to create this build, man, it was just a lot of things that 2K wanted me to do for me to get John Moran in the shades of. So I had to kind of do some things that I don't normally do. But you know, it's all good. We still get John Moran in the shades of. So for the driver dunk, as you see, it can't go to a 96. If you go 6-3, you can get that 96. And um, that's just what it is. Let me make. Let me see. Let me see. Can you take the weight all the way down and get a 96? I got the wingspan max out. I don't even think you can take the weight all the way down and get it. Let's see. Now nah, you can't even take the weight all the way down and get it. So um, you can't get that 96 at eight, at six foot two. Okay. So we're gonna take the weight back up to where we had it at. I just had to test that out, man. So um, okay, with the driver dunk, like I said, we do get a 94 on that. That's pretty good. We get an 80 on the driver layup. Um, the close shot goes up on his own. Now, I don't know why 2K wanted me to add post control on John. You don't have to. Um, but when I was trying to create the bill, you know, um, I got his name every time with the post control. So I was like, well, hell, I'm going to leave the post control on the bill because it's cheap anyway. So might as well put it on the bill. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, you get drop step and you get post spin technician. So that's really, really good for a bill like this. And we're going to go down to the vertical. Make sure. That you take your vertical to an 85. All right. You can take it to an 82. Yeah, that's fine. You get the elite contact dunks. But at 85, you get those small contact dunks. So that's why we took it to an 85. Uh, for the strength, we're going to bump that up. And now we go back up. As you can see, we do get gold posterizer, Hall of Fame, Slithery. We got Bundy, Spin Cycle, two-step on Hall of Fame, which is really, really good. Uh, we will be able to get uh, spin, uh, I said that already. We get protest on Hall of Fame. Um, what else? We get gold giant slayer, which is good. <clears throat> Excuse me. We also get fearless finish on silver, so that's pretty good as well. We got some standard dunk. You do get the standard dunk animations on this build, so I think that's really good too. Now let's get into the green beam, make your girl screen badge, and we're going to take the three point shot all the way up to a 77. And uh, I wanted the name Slasher for this build. I didn't want floor spacing Slasher. Um, even though John Morant has improved on this three-point shot, but he's not shooting threes like that, you know what I'm saying? So uh, we do have some three-point shooting on this bill. I tried to get the mid-range up, but it's just it's just too much to try to um, to do on this bill, you know, given the fact that you have such high driving dunk, you gotta take the vertical up super high, you gotta have good playmaking, and you know, it's just, it's just unfortunate that we had to take a hit on the shooting, okay? But a 77 is okay. You know what I'm saying? I'm not telling you guys to go do a 77 three-point shooting build because a lot of people can't shoot with a low three like that, and I totally understand. So I'm not telling you you have to create this build, but it's still a good build for the people that can play on the build, all right? But for the people that can't, it may not be a good build for you, okay? But for the people that can, it's a great build, okay? Now let's go ahead and get into the sauce. But before we do, I need you guys to do me a huge favor, right? Go down there, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that share button, and let the video play to the end because that will push the video to the recommended page so everybody mama can see this video. And I need everybody mama to see the video. So do that for your boy, boy. With the pass accuracy, we're going to get that up to a 77, which I think is is the lowest I would go, all right? So that's why I did the 77 because it's the lowest that I would go for a point guard. Um, a lot of people, they, they like the 77 passing on the point guard. I don't know why, but... You know, it's not that bad. You know, you still can make good passes on this bill no matter where you go. You know, I would prefer to get it to an 84, but I couldn't get it to an 84. I tried, I tried, I tried. Trust me, I tried. All right, but a 77 should get the job done. For the ball handle, we're going to bump that up to a 93. I know some people will probably say take it to a 92, but a 93 does unlock ankle break on Hall of Fame, okay? And we get that uh, killer combos on gold, as you guys can see. So we'll take that, all right? For the speed ball, we're going to take that to an 83. 
And if we come down to the speed and acceleration, we're going to take that up so we can get what we need when it comes to the badges. Okay, so as you can see, we get triple strike on gold, speed boost to gold, hyperdrive, blow by. We also get um, handle for days. That's going to be on gold. Um, Unpluckable is on gold. Anchor Breaker is on Hall of Fame. Physical Handles is on silver. That's why I took the strength to a 63. And we're looking good, man. Uh, we got Needle Threader. We got Diamond Relay Passer. Um, touch passer, break starter. We do get rebound on this build too. I forgot about that. You know what I'm saying? So um, it just was unfortunate for the other part of the build, which is the shooting. I still don't like that. You know, but to each his own man on that. And um, we're just going to continue doing what we do and get to the defense. Right. With the defense, we want some defense, but we can't get too much defense. Right. So we're going to at least get the bare minimum. Okay, this is the bare minimum on defense, and I don't know why they wanted me to add some interior defense to this build, but they wanted me to add interior defense to it. I tried to take it down. They took John Moran's name away, which is dumb as hell. I don't understand that. But uh, we do have a 45 interior defense. We got a 76 on the perimeter defense. Like I said, that's the bare minimum. Uh, we still get clamps. We still get 94 feet, ankle braces, challenger, all the badges that you see over there to the right. We still get those badges, but, you know, you're not out there to be – uh, a perimeter defender or anything like that man you're out there to have fun with this build man dunking on people you know uh passing to your teammates dribbling breaking ankles and all that stuff okay we also have a 72 steal now you could take the steal all the way down and take the perimeter defense up high if you want to that would be good too so you can get those bump animation but be aware that it will probably take john moran name away if you do it that way so i just left it like this 76 72 okay on the block we got a 30 on that um the rebound i don't know why they wanted me to add the rebound to the bill but we got a 60 rebound on this bill so we get rebound chaser um we don't get box or anything like that because we're too short but we do get rebound chaser right so with the speed we have an 86 that's what we need to get to get the badges uh we got an 83 acceleration 63 on the strength 85 on the vert and the wrist is on stamina and as you guys can see we do get the gold handle for days on this build so you can do a lot of dribbling if you want to that's totally up to you and we also get that 94 feet that's why we got the 76 perimeter defense instead of the 75 but let's get into the shades of are you ready because guess what i do not click back here we go here we go here we go now check out these shades of though we got russ we got steve francis and we got John Morant. All three, um, well, the two, Russ and uh, Steve Francis, work great finishes, man. They can finish really, really good. And John Morant, um, he does play like that, man. He can finish really, really good. And as you can see, we do get him in the shades up. And the build is a slasher, man. That's the build. Make sure you like the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel. I'm out of here, man. Chat!